What is Wi-Fi? Wi-Fi is a family of wireless network protocols. It is based on the IEEE 802.11 family of standards, which are used for local area networking of devices and internet access. Wi-Fi uses radio waves to transmit data from your wireless router to your Wi-Fi enabled devices such as your TV, smartphone, tablet, and computer. The Wi-Fi network is simply an internet connection that's shared with multiple devices in a home or business via a wireless router. The router is connected directly to your internet modem and acts as a hub to broadcast the internet signal to all your Wi-Fi enabled devices. This offers flexibility to stay connected to the internet as long as you're within your network coverage area. Advantages of Wi-Fi Compared to a wired network connection, wireless networks offer advantages in terms of cost and labor. When installing a new Wi-Fi network, you can cut down the expenses in wiring and maintenance, since a very less number of wires are used here. It can save bigger amount in company's overall budget. Wireless networks enable multiple users to connect through the same network. Connections can be made through the router or a hotspot technology. This ease of use and convenience is not present in wired networks. In a wired network, it takes more time to configure and allow access to multiple users. You can add new users to the Wi-Fi network easily. With the proper wireless LAN credentials, more users can access the Wi-Fi network, and there is no need to install any new type of equipment. All can be done with the existing, this saves time and effort of the clients. Wi-Fi allows you to can carry out your regular works from anywhere you want especially with mobile devices. You don't have to sit right in front of the computer to get internet access. Such works include, bank transactions, email sending, and checking work reports. There is no complexity of cables being run in different locations and operating switches. You can accomplish your assigned tasks with a Wi-Fi network. You can experience different ranges of speed as they move from one location to another, and there are least chances of experiencing technical glitches with a wireless LAN, so, you can be more engaged and be able to deliver their timely targets and works, enhancing the overall productivity of the company. Disadvantages of Wi-Fi Wi-Fi can cause health issues to human, some of them are cancer, insomnia, and apoptosis, same as the effects caused by microwave frequencies EMF, and it is advised for pregnant women not to get exposed to the Wi-Fi signals as it releases electromagnetic radiations. However, many encryption techniques are taken by wireless networks. The Wi-Fi is vulnerable to hacking due to its wireless nature, so it has a high chance of being hacked especially the public Wi-Fi networks. Since public Wi-Fi networks are open to anyone, hackers can impose their fake networking ID. Without consent users may connect to this fake ID and fall into the category of cyber attack victims. The Wi-Fi network works at a frequency of 2.4 GHz. This frequency has a high chance of getting hindered due to electromagnetic waves and other forms of obstacles. So, you may experience connectivity issues and weak signal strengths. Especially during large file transfers the signal can get interfered. The range offered by the Wi-Fi network is limited, around 100 to 150 feet. While it is sufficient for normal home, it can be a problem for building structures. The strength of the Wi-Fi network will be reduced as you move away from the access point. Since the building is multi-storied, the strength of the Wi-Fi network can be varying at different floors. This cloud weakens the company's workflow. The only way to overcome this is by purchasing additional access points. Many routers allow 30 maximum devices to be connected. The bandwidth of the Wi-Fi network gets weaker as you add more devices. It is solely reserved for a single user, and when the bandwidth gets limited users can experience slow speeds. The speed of Wi-Fi connections is slower than the wired connection, around 1 to 54 Mbps which is to just one device connected to the dedicated servers. Thank you for watching if you like this content, don't forget to like, subscribe, and share this video.